Hey guys, my name is Alex and welcome back to my Space Engineers video. Um, so last episode I was saying I wanted to start working on a big ship, so I think I'm going to start doing that this episode because I really want to get something a little bit more done than just this hangar. The hangar is awesome and everything and I'm very pleased with it. Uh, two things I want to say quickly, I'm not sure I mentioned this last episode or not, but a multiplayer update came out. So now there's multiplayer. And also, the other day, um, another update came out. I'm not sure if this was in this update or the other update, but I'm, I'm, I'm only noticing it now, so I'm pretty sure it was in the last update, uh, is the lights now actually take, like, the, the actual, before they used to be white and just give off an orange light, now they actually change their actual texture, so they actually match the color, which is awesome, and if you come here, you see the blue and the red, which is also pretty cool. Let me make sure I don't hit that, because I don't want to start flying off into oblivion. But it's awesome, because now I can really start making some cool things. So I can't wait for that. Um, otherwise, yeah. So that's pretty much all I've done. Um, and just to show you guys the lights a bit more, because it's pretty awesome. Oh, also they uh, added uh, heavy armor. Heavy armor, I'm going to assume. I've yet to really play with it, but I'm going to assume it does takes more uh, damage than anything else. So let's go green, sure. And now if we see there, the whole light itself actually changed green, which is pretty cool. Uh, okay. So... The heavy air armor is once survival actually comes out, I'm gonna assume it's gonna be a lot more expensive to make, so it's not gonna be easy to make. But I mean still gonna be very useful and very cool. So I'm probably gonna be building my ship out of the heavy armor instead of the light because well, because I can. Okay. So let's get started with this quickly here because I want to really start working on it. So this hunk of junk here, I'm gonna keep it here because eh. I've got that thing up there, so what do I want to actually start building? I might start building my ship out. Um, I can start it here, and I can always move it as need be, so I'll start it right here. Sure, why not? And G. So let's start a new large ship. Okay, cool. Now I'm going to pull out the uh, heavy armor blocks. The yeah, let's just go with heavy armor. Okay. That can lag my game too. Cool. I've been noticing uh, since last update I've been getting some FPS drops. I don't know why. So if it keeps happening, I don't know if I'll be able to continue doing space energy until I can kind of get that resolved. So it's going to kind of suck, but you know what? I can deal with it for now at least. See, now, now I'm getting 60 FPS again. I don't know. I just I get FPS drops randomly. Now I'm curious though if I can actually change the color of heavy blocks. I would assume so. Oh, I can. That's pretty neat. Oh, oh, okay. Okay. Wait. No, wait a second. No, no, no. See, so, you know, if I change color, I get as massive FPS drop. That looks pretty cool, not gonna lie. You know why it looks camo? Looks military. I can do military. That I can do. Okay. So let's start building. Um I'm first gonna get a nice layout out, so that's cool. I wanna make it fairly big, so I'm what I'm gonna do is first build the first level. And then we're gonna work from there. Get rid of that. Okay, so now I've got that going. That looks pretty good. I like the yellow, not gonna lie. I'm gonna stick with that for now. Might change color later, but whatever. Okay, now, first things I need to do is where's five? I need to put. I'm gonna remove these later. It's just for now because I really don't wanna screw shit up. I'm gonna put a gyroscope down, a reactor, so I have power to this thing, and I'm gonna put some engines on it. Just because if I do hit it, I don't want it to start flying away magically and yeah. Okay, so now I'm pretty sure I have one on every direction, I think. So let's just plop one of these things down. Right, I need to put a gravity generator. That would help. A gravity generator. Okay. Sure, I think that worked. And now let's hit K. Wrong button. 
and let's zoom out. Okay, so it is being gyroscopically thingied, stayed here, so that's good. Good, so now I don't have to worry about hitting it. Only thing is, it would be nice if there'd be a level to, it, to this thing, but whatever. Okay, so now I know I've got it leveled, we're good. So now we can start building some smexy ass stuff. Okay, so how do I want to uh, pl basically play this out? I know for sure I want to have a hangar in it, uh, that's a given. So I can have a couple of small ships in it. How big I want to make the hangar, I don't know yet. So, yeah. Um, hmm. I'm gonna have to remove that one, but that's fine. I'll put that back here in a second. I'm gonna make this. Okay. Now, how big is that? That should be a good way to test how big it is that I find is go here, control, and go across. Eight, huh? Eight. No, I need to go nine. Okay. So I need to go one more. So I kind of have it. See, now I'm getting 40 FPS again. I don't know what it is. It's just I get these FPS drops somehow. But okay, that's fine. So I've got nine. That'll be a good platform to start with, I think. So I don't want to be making it too big. Like, I doubt I'm going to finish it this episode. Like, that's most likely not. However, I still want to get a decent amount of it done. I swear I'm going to rebind some of these keys because this is annoying me. I want control to be my down. I don't think... Dude, wait a second. Does it even exist? Please tell me I can rebind. I don't think I can, though. No. Oh, maybe. Now we, oh, I can. Okay. Uh, navigation, crouch down, screw you, control. Yeah. Weapons is going to be tool or fire is going to be, yeah, left mouse button. I don't want a keyboard shot. Okay, good. Good, so now control. Okay, that's much better. Happy. Okay, so now I've got that done. How do I want to play this out? Um, I'm thinking, honestly, I kind of want to... Actually, is this even a good enough hanger? This might even just be my hanger right here. This going to be the floor of my hanger. Um, I can see that happening. Okay. Shit. Oh, wait a second. I can't use control, can I? No, I can't. Ah, damn it. I just realized control doesn't work. Fine, I'll rebind it. Whatever. Um, just see. Forget it. Fine. Crap. Because control is what I needed to do that. I think think. Um, no, I don't want that. Actually, no, that's going to be my hanger right, so I don't need that. I need this. Okay. I need to, first off, go, how do I want to play? So difficult building, because you don't know really what you want to build half the time. You just kind of loafed. Build, but I'm cool with that. Okay. That looks nice. I have an idea of what I'm doing here. Actually, no, maybe I should be building with symmetry on. What button is symmetry? There's a button, I know, because I've seen it being used before. Systems. Um, where's symmetry? Okay, that's interesting. There should be a symmetry thing, but I don't see it. Uh, do 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 symmetry switch M. There we go. That's what I wanted. So 
So if I put M on, okay, that works. So now if I build anything over here, Um, okay, there we go. There we go. So now if I build, I can have it all nice and leveled. However, is that symmetrical? In terms of if I put that there, what does that put there? No, that's not symmetrical. Hmm. Okay, well, whatever. Maybe I'll just remove that layer. Okay, good enough. There we go. So now, technically, if I build along there, now I think if I did this correctly. Oh, you know what it is? Eh, fine. You know, I don't like symmetry. No, I don't really like this whole symmetry thing. I'm going to get rid of it because I don't like it. Okay, never mind. Ignore me. Fine, whatever. Okay, so I'm going to put that back. Damn it. Wrong button again. And then I want to now, right, it's control. Okay, so I'm going to build up the other side here in a minute. But what I want now is stairs. I definitely do want to have stairs in my hangar room because it's going to be important to me. I don't know, I always feel like stairs should be a, just should be a must in a hangar room. But that's not symmetrical, is it? No, okay, that's gonna have to do. And then Okay. There. And then I take six and I put one there. Now from there I can build up and out this thing. I'm going to have my door along in there and there. Okay. Good. Now we've got some stairs in our hangar room. Now we can start to build this layer of the ship. Sure, 64. Okay. Beautiful. So that looks good. And now I'm probably going to put the brig up here and then have my engines. Oh, actually, no, I might do that. I kind of like that idea. Okay. I have an idea of how I'm going to build this whole thing already. It's a smarticle, barnacle idea. I like it because I made up the idea. <laughs> so therefore, it must be good. And then I'm going to put another one of those layers up there, like that. I'm going to do the same staircase thing I did over there, but I'll do that here in a minute. And then I'm going to go here. I'm going to control, click, till I have basically the whole thing encapsulated. Oh, shit. What happened there? Why did that start magically floating away? No. Okay, that was not what I wanted. Um, that's cool. Okay, stop it. Stop it. No. Stop it. 
this is why you have problems very quickly with stuff. Uh, I have to make sure to not script again like this because this is bad. This is bad, 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 bad. Spam click. Spam delete. No. Okay. Okay. Good. I'm lived. I'm living. Um, so let me just... Is that the center block? There it is. Nope. Shit. This time around we shouldn't lose ourselves. Hopefully. Let me make sure I actually still have all the thrusters on where they should be. I don't have it on there. Okay. That's interesting. Go away, auto saving crap. Not important. Well, it's very important, but not to me right now. It's not. Why won't you let me? Okay, fine. Just there. Good enough. Whatever. I don't care. I just want to place this thing. Okay, good. Now I've got engines. Okay, this time, since I actually connected it, it shouldn't be going anywhere. So I'm going to hit 6 now. Okay. And then back here is going to be my engine room. So. Okay. And then, good enough. Okay. Now I'm going to go down here. Yeah, whatever, I just sealed the whole thing off. I'll get rid of it here in a second. And then that one, I think. Should be. Yep. Now I go 8. Place that down there. I just realize. Nope. Okay, good. And place that down there. Okay. Good. Now if I hit V, I can go into first person, we can hit zero. And I hit zero. Tab that out. And we've now got a cool coolio ass ship. Okay, I'm, I can do I can deal with that. Uh now I want to pull out I actually don't want to pull anything out. I want to put in that. Okay. Put door there. Door there. Okay, and now with that, I can put a nice uh, lamps. So I'll put in here in a second. But with this, I can now put in. I have a small reactor, a large reactor. can put in two large reactors and then to be even more fancy about it okay good so now I've got some large reactors in here and some of that I can get rid of this reactor because it's going to be in the way my gravity engine, I'm going to stick Yep, and then got gyroscopes I'm going to surround the rest of the reactor with it the more gyroscopes you have the quicker you can turn essentially so they are definitely important okay now with this I can go six and I can fill up this wall here to finish off our reactor room. Now I'm definitely gonna make this less boxy and like put some nice corners in it and try to make it very elegant, but I'm just getting the skeletal structure done. So that's that's basically what this video is, it's pretty much skeletal structure of the ship itself, which is pretty awesome. Okay, not bad. So yeah, I'm gonna like even off that corner and make it a little bit more awesome. Oh, 
Why won't you let me place your block down there? There we go. Oh. Oh. That's interesting. Okay. How about you go up? Up. <laughs> up we go. Please tell me I actually went up. Nope. Damn it. Oh, you know what it is? It's because I built this section. Ah. Fine. Have to get rid of this whole section of the ship. Have to rebuild it. Okay, I'll do that. Just fine. Be mean. That's a cool game. That is cool. Just do that to me. The reason why I have to rebuild it is because the ship itself was not actually built onto this. See, and then I won't even let me place that because these were built off of that. Okay. So I need to make sure I connect the whole ship and I don't screw up like that again. That was an issue. But thankfully, that's an easy rebuild because I, ha I know those commands, which I didn't know before, but now I do. So that's an easy rebuild. Just there we go. Okay. Good. See, now that's going to be annoying. Now that I know that that is all there, and I can put up the three level, and I can break out the door. Good. Good, good, good. I'll put that door back later and save the stairs. Not important. But what is important is this actual thing. I built that on it, didn't I? I did. Uh, okay. I'll, I'll, I'll deal with that. That's fine. think that's the same height probably not but it'll work and then okay beautiful so now we've got essentially the hangar that should be able to fit a small ship inside of it yeah that can fit a small ship inside of it if you drive in you can have one two spots for small ships or cargo whatever you want to call it um, actually speaking of cargo I should probably have some cargo bays oh Ew. okay never thought that through um. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, I know how I can play this. That's fine. No, I need to keep that. Um. Actually, no, I don't have it connected to the rest of the ship. But I'm gonna keep it anyway. Um. I kind of want to actually break this out. Yeah, I'm gonna break this whole section out. I don't even know. That's gonna stay there though. However, this wall isn't. That's gonna get dropped out. Okay. Eh. Oh shit. Goodbye. Uh, the reason why I'm doing this actually is because I want to put cargo bay in here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have this nicely all like that. Well, not cargo. Yeah, basically cargo bay. Uh, storage. So we can basically come in here and unload ships. And then, I don't know why I'm doing this way. I can just do that. Save time. And then do the same thing here. Like that. Like that. Okay, beautiful. Now I can pull out the cargo containers. So I'm going to get rid of the gyroscopes. The small thrusts I'm going to have to put back. I don't need that. Cockpit I'll need. I don't need that. So let's pull out that, that, and that. So I'm going to put five. These things are monsters. So I'm going to put 
Actually, I'm only going to put one of these things. Uh, see, I kind of want to have... Eh, I'm debating if I really want to build the ship out just for this. <sighs> um, actually, that could work. That could look quite nice. I'll do that. There we go. Let's build it basically right into the wall, which is what I'm totally cool with. Let's put it in. I think I did it like that. Because now, what I'm going to do is, from the outside, I'm going to make it look definitely better. But I'm basically going to put, like, caps on it. Or actually, maybe not. Maybe we could have it kind of like, it's kind of like a docking thing. We can kind of dock up and fuel from outside the ship. No idea how I'm going to do that, though. I'm going to seal it off. Um, oh, I know how, actually. I got an idea. I got an idea. There we go. For now, I'll keep it like that. I have an idea of what I can do with it, but I'll do that later. I really want to get this done. I'm going to put also the front back on, and then that'll be the end of this video, because it's already probably getting at like the 20-minute mark. Maybe even more. I kind of lose track. I don't really even see. I never really actually time myself on my videos. I probably should, but whatever. Not important. Okay. Now I can put back that block with that block with that. And no. That. Okay. Now I want to put in the rest of these things. So these small cargo containers are quite nice because they're quite small. The threes, three. Oh, medium cargo is not available. Okay. So then, okay, that works. That's fine with me. Just so we've got two monster cargos, and then some smaller cargos. Cool with that. Actually, I might put a second. Should I put a second monster cargo in? Uh, I might. Yeah, I can put them side by side. Sure, why not? That looks quite nice for cargo. See, now right now the cargo things kind of have no use because it's all creative. But I, honestly, I'm really looking forward to actual survival coming out because then I'm going to start an actual let's play. Of this, I'm going to be badasses building and actually, you know, doing a little bit more than what we can do now. Okay. That looks quite nice. Okay. See, now what my idea is, is basically cover it up like that. However, leave a hole there. Yeah, there we go. That looks nice. Leave a hole there. So you can basically access the cargo from outside if need be. Uh, maybe not the smartest idea, but whatever. I like it, so don't hate. Uh, and then do the same here. Boom and boom. That was pretty cool. I'm quite happy with that. Now what I'm going to do is come here and extend this thing out to about there. I'm going to have my whole, like, cockpit in here which is gonna be pretty cool I hope when I'm done with it but I mean we'll have to see there we go and then that should be right there the center yeah okay now I've got that done I'm gonna oh shit I just realized that no I just realized that's not actually connected. It's probably the same here, isn't it? Yeah. Damn it. Okay, then. I gotta connect them. Uh, I can do that. That's not a problem. I'm gonna change these out after for something else, but for now that'll work.
now it's all connected. Um, the reason why I'm going to change these out for those um, like flat ones. I didn't realize that. I gotta make sure I be careful with that because next thing I'm going to be losing half my ship again. <laughs> The more I build this, the more good it looks, in my opinion. So I'm quite happy with how I'm building it. That should be all connected, and I should be able to access that and that through my access ports. Okay. That is pretty awesome. Now, this thing is not going to be defenseless, but it's going to be a little bit more defenseless. In terms of it's a little bit more of a cargo carrier than anything else. So that's pretty awesome. Um, I'm definitely going to be changing the doors a bit. And everything, but I don't know. I think I'm quite happy with what I have now. I'm gonna just fix this up to the way I would like it, just like that. But no. Okay, there we go. And I'm gonna probably build my cockpit right there. It's gonna be kind of a more round one. Be a little bit more different than that kind of a ship, but for now I'm quite pleased with what I what I got. Uh, it's a good ske skeleton of kind of what I'm building. I need to add thrusters and everything, but I can do that later. So I'm gonna save my game, and this is gonna be the uh, end of this video. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and come back next time. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually start working a little bit more of the uh, nice design aspect of it, and kind of fixing it up and making it look nicer. Also, probably gonna put that finish off the uh, top level of it put some maybe nice windows in and really try to make it look good and try to make it really look like a decent ship. So right now it's just it's literally a skeleton it looks like crap but when I'm done with it it should look badass so that's what I'm going for so please leave a comment about what you think and what you think of this video also please hit that like button because then it shows me that you guys like what I'm doing and that you like kind of the whole space engineers kind of thing I'm doing uh, and finally uh, please subscribe if you're new to my channel and you're not already subscribed. So for now, that's all I'm going to say, and uh, thanks for watching.